This presentation is to go over a brief tutorial about how to use the iPad application Edu Creations. We'll be going over the basic tools. Okay, so now we're going to talk about the drawing element of this program. In the top left hand side of your screen, you would be able to see three colored squares with pull down tabs. Each pull down tab enables you to pick and select different colors to use. So let's, for instance, say I pick black. I can start doodling it, as you can see. I can use blue, red, orange, any color that the application allows to create whatever handy dandy doodle you want to use. And when you're done, you'll pick the eraser square in the top right hand side of your screen to delete the image itself or just pick the eraser to delete certain line segments. To insert text, you will tap on the T button on the toolbar. After it turns blue, tap anywhere on the screen to insert a text box. Once you insert it, you will be able to type the word. To move the text around after you type it, just click and hold on it and it will move around the screen like so. You can also duplicate your text by pressing the duplicate button on the toolbar that will show up. Once you press it, a second word will pop up, just like this. To change the size and the font, you can go to the text options. After clicking on the word, you'll see a T minus or T plus button and you will be able to change the size. You can also change the color by clicking on the color box. So now you'll see that I have a larger font size and it is now the color black. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about images. At the top of your screen, you would see a camera icon that has a drop down to a camera, photos, Dropbox, and web. All of these can be used to import various images. I used photos to import a fantastic image that is displayed here. Awesome, isn't it? So in this program, we can use it to move the image, we can enlarge the image, we can make it smaller, and play around with it like that. As you can see, kitty chin, fantastic. Okay, we can also, in this application, we can draw on it with the colors that I pr described previously in this video. We can rotate it, and notice the color stays the same. We can duplicate the image and move one or both of the images. We can also delete one without deleting the other. Alright, and then once you're done with this image, you can use the erase button in the top right hand of the screen to erase whatever you've added to it, or the image itself. The last feature is the insert paper. You can do line paper, graph paper, you can also insert coordinate paper, and you can also draw on top of it. So if you want to do an axis, and maybe a couple points on the axis, you can. You can also undo them pressing the undo button so you're left with the regular graph paper.